قرآني نبض حياتي قرآني طهر ذاتي قرآني عصمة أمري قرآني طوق نجاتي I knew an Imam in a masjid in one of the suburbs in Melbourne. He was very, he was from Afghanistan, very simple, not much wealth, very humble. And he was the fourth Imam of the masjid. See, some masjids we have, they, they rotate between several Imams. Now this Imam, he hardly prays because usually the other Imams are before him. One day in Ramadan, on the fourth day, and let me tell you the hadith before I say this story. Rasulullah says, "Ida ahab Allahu abdan asala." If Allah loves a servant, He will sweeten him. They said, "Ya Rasulullah, what does it mean to sweeten him or her?" He says, "It means that before they die, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will beautify their actions and make them die on a beautiful death." with a beautiful end so he beautifies his death decorates their end and think of the other hadith if Allah loves a servant he puts him through trials put these two together those who go through trials and are patient are those whom Allah loves them this Imam hardly prays one of my friends he says I was late to Fajr prayer subhanAllah I woke up a little bit late I missed suhoor and I made wudu I went to the masjid and I found that they had already started in their first rak'ah and they were already in sujood. Everybody was quiet in sujood. So I looked and subhanAllah, it happened to be the fourth Imam praying. You know, the first Imam, second Imam, third Imam were away. They were also late. Qaddar Allah. What are the chances of this fourth Imam being praying? in Fajr time in sujood on the fourth day of Ramadan Wallahi fourth day of Ramadan he said I came water is dripping from wudu coming to join the prayers suddenly he says I noticed from entering into the masjid and getting into the line they stayed in sujood longer than usual so I looked closely and I saw the Imam slouching a bit in his sujood you know not normal sujood but he was in sujood but so I came closer to him and I noticed the Imam had died. Wallahi, the Imam was dead. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had taken his soul in that sujood. And the people stood up. Allahu Akbar, subhanallah, Allahu Akbar. If Allah loves a servant, he tries them. And if he loves a servant, he beautifies their end.